Breaking news now coming in. Ministry of External Affairs has issued a statement over the tensions in West Asia. The statement reads, um, quote, we are deeply concerned by the evolving escalation in West Asia and its ramifications for peace and stability in the region and beyond, unquote. It further said that, uh, I quote, our missions are in the region are in contact with the Indian community. Now, this comes after Israel, what they called was a retaliation, a revenge of uh, the attack that was carried out by the Iranians, where 180 missiles were launched by Iran as uh, a response to the assassination of Hezbollah chief uh, Hassan Nasrallah. In fact, Israel has come on record to state that they have targeted military sites of Iran. Having said that, the damage assessment is not known. You've had the Iranians basically responding already by saying that this was a violation of their territorial sovereignty and also a violation of international standard protocols. Having said that, remember, India has now issued a statement uh, being extremely cautious about the current situation where they say that they are deeply concerned about the evolving escalation in West Asia. Remember, the United States of America has also responded uh, by indicating that uh, they are hoping that this will now bring an end uh, to the fight between Iran and Israel. Having said that, they've also warned Iranians that if at all there is some sort of a retaliation, then they are going to openly back Israel and protect Israel. Now, that's the position that the United States of America has also taken. Overall picture, if you take a look at it right now, uh, ladies and gentlemen, one is the fact that uh, they are essentially trying to diffuse the matter, hoping that there would not be any sort of a retaliation really coming in from the Iranians side at this point in time. Having said that, the latest statement that was put out by the Iranians essentially indicated that they are monitoring the situation and they say that there hasn't been large-scale destruction as claimed by the Israelis. That's the latest now coming in after the late night strikes that were carried out, which the Israelis are calling precision strikes that were carried out by them as a response to the 180 missiles that were launched by Iran.